Hey, this is a quick tutorial on how I make my iPod and iPhone videos and how I make them in really high quality. This was requested by Saxyman98 and his channel link is down in the sub bar. So go check him out and see what he's got. And by the way, just so you know, if you request a video and I end up doing it, uh, this I, I will give people your channel link down in the sub bar. So feel free to uh, request any type of video. First things first, you're going to want to make sure you have a jailbroken iPhone or iPod or, or iPad. If you don't, you're going to have to go figure out how to do that depending on what firmware you have. Because there is no screen recording software for iPhones that don't require a jailbreak. Steve Jobs doesn't allow that type of stuff. <laughs> and now if you have that, the next thing you want to get is iDemo. iDemo is what I use to view it on my computer. This is it right here. Um, iDemo works both on the Mac operating system, as you can see here, and on Windows computers. And what I like about it is that it actually gives the visual of like the body of the phone. Like you can see here, it's not just the screen, it's the body too. And the VNC programs that you can get show just the screen. So I think this just looks better. Uh, the only problem is this one, you would have to purchase a license and it is 15 US dollars and I'm not promoting this behavior but if you're looking for cheaper prices of it Google is your friend feel free to Google that type of stuff but all of mine is legitimately paid for um, that applies to actually every program that I have you could always just look on Google Shh, don't tell people after you get that and you install iDemo you're gonna get something like this this is what it looks like on your computer if it would open up there we go this is what it looks like and because you don't have the app to make it run you're just gonna see this screen it just says searching for devices and the the app you need to get is called screen splitter uh, screen splitter lets you uh, connect your device to this so you can see it the other good thing about iDemo is that you don't need Wi-Fi. You can do it over USB. If you don't have Wi-Fi, you just need the screen splitter app. I'm going to jump ahead real quick and show you where to get screen splitter and just how to install it. So you're going to want to open up Cydia. After everything loads, you're going to go to the search tab down here and search for screen splitter. It is spelled S C R E E N S P L I T R, as you can see right here. Screen splitter. You're going to search for that and install it from the Big Boss source. It comes from the Big Boss source. After doing that, you're going to get, um, hopefully, not this this is what it looks like when you're connecting it you're gonna get this app right here the screen splitter app on your screen uh, which you're, you're just gonna wanna open that and when you do it will take you back to this screen it'll take you to this screen and if you're connected via USB it will also have the option with USB I'm only connected during uh, to the Wi-Fi so it only shows the Wi-Fi option so you just click that and if it's the Wi-Fi option, a message will pop up asking you for uh, asking you to accept the connection from your computer. All you do is accept it, and then it pops away, and then you get this, and you can now view your screen on your computer. Now that we got it on the computer, what we're going to have to do next, obviously, is record it. And for screen recording, I use the program ZDSoft and the purchase version which you're gonna want and need is um, right over here just google ZD soft
the purchase version of this costs thirty nine dollars as you can see thirty nine US dollars but it's well worth it I think it's really good and you can also uh, record voiceovers while re screen recording so like I am now if you're using a microphone you just have to make sure that in the options under audio you have m uh, the microphone option selected that way it'll record your voice as you pick it up you can also do voiceovers if you want just do the screen recording and then you can do a voiceover in my video editing software which I'll show next um, for video settings on ZD soft I wish I could show you but I can't because I'm using it right now I can't view the settings while I'm using it you go to um, under the video tab you're gonna see a uh, different options I have mine set on to selected uh, selected uh, I have it set to record uh, selection so there will just be a spot um, a little box that pops up on your computer and you can drag it over different things uh, in this case I have it uh, over the iPhone screen not right now though not right now I have it to record the full desktop and for video recording or editing that's the video recording is ZD soft for video editing is the program cyberlink power director 9 it's very good and I highly re recommend it and it's also how I get my videos in HD this is the page for it and it's a little pricey the deluxe version is 70 US dollars and the ultra version is 90 US dollars but it is extremely extremely um, useful it has YouTube and Facebook integration and it also comes with wave editor and a couple other programs which is useful for editing the volume and stuff and this is what it actually looks like you can actually see me editing this video right now which is kinda of funny <laughs> Um, it has really good effects in it and a really useful and user friendly uh, interface. And then over here, this is how I get them in H HQ high quality HD video. Over here on the pr uh, prod produce tab, um, you're going to come over here to profile type and then have it selected on full HD quality under the YouTube tab. If you have it on YouTube, you can type in your username and password here and you can. Uh, select what uh, quality you want it full HD quality is what I use and it takes a little bit of time to publish it but it is very very good as you've seen my videos are all really high quality and it works great and I really love it so yep that is it this program str uploads straight to YouTube takes out all the uh, hard work and it's an, an amazing high quality if you have any more questions about this or how I do things, feel free to message me or comment on my channel. If you want any other tutorials or videos or reviews done over anything, it's just comment on my channel asking what you want. Uh, please thumb up and subscribe.